Now, what's this thing? I mean, there's no Mickey Thompson wide tires on this. Larry, boat racing. Uh, I loved it. Uh, won a lot of boat races. This is a marathon boat here, but we went, uh, won to go Gold Cup boat racing. I won to set the world water speed record, and uh, that was a disaster. I built a boat we thought would fly, and it did fly. every type of boat race available, using a regular automotive stock block engine, which was usually under horsepower. So I designed a hull using one of the first hydroplane aerodynamic approaches, which I believe would lift the hull out of the water for less friction and more speed. As I was running across the lake at probably 150, I hit an unexpected weight. life jacket was all but ripped from his body. Two crushed vertebra caused what doctors believed to be irreversible spinal cord damage. It was quickly determined that Mickey Thompson was permanently paralyzed from the waist down. However, there was a difference of medical opinion between Thompson and his physicians. They wanted him in a full body cast for months a lengthy period of rehabilitation, possibly extensive surgery. Six months later, his condition had not improved. A general lack of medical trust, combined with total boredom, caused Thompson to leave the hospital. Some friends helped him remove the cast, and Mickey created a home-built therapy device consisting of one pulley and a length of rope. The more he moved, the more pain he felt. But at least feeling was returning to his legs. After six more months, defying doctors who said he would never walk again, Mickey Thompson went jogging. Mm -hmm.